Welcome back to Noble Fates. When you are building your your homes for your people, and then you want to upgrade your bed, we have some troubles. If you play this, this wooden bed is example straw bed, and you want to replace that straw bed with wooden bed, what you are going to do? If you remove that bed, you lose that, you lose that uh, bedroom, and you get penalty for person. What if we place another bed in this room? Now it's tier four apartment, and if we place one extra bed, boom. It's very high prestige bunk room. And that's definitely something that we don't want. And again, someone lost lost a bedroom and building and is now very unhappy that you stole something what they had. How we can avoid this? Well, technically we can't. Except with mods. Welcome to modding tutorial for Noble Fates. Let's check out what mod can change this mechanic and make your life a little bit easier and how to install that mod. First thing you need to do is jump in github.com, link down below in the description. Mod name is Allow Bed Replacement and it it's just small tweak for definition of bunk room right now if you have two beds in one room it's automatically bunk room but with this mod you must have at least three beds in that room or two unincluded beds in that room so it will change as bunk room so it stays as, as bedroom even if, if there's two beds. Side effect of this mod is that example your if you want to give a good room for your visitors, you can do it. You can just place extra bed in your rooms. Every single room that you have, you can have extra bed and then visitors like you more and who knows maybe they want to join join your kingdom. But you can you can do that. They don't have to sleep. They don't have to sleep in, in outside and ground, you can be a good host. How we can install this mod? Well, up here is code, click that and download zip file. Then extract this zip file and you get this folder. Keep this folder, Noble Fates allow bed replacement master, somewhere close by. Then type present app data present and then go in app data local low common LLC and noble face. If you don't have a mod folder, create mod folder. And then simple thing, you take this whole allow bed replacements folder which is extracted folder where we have two files drag this whole folder inside mods folder not these files inside whole folder and that's it now it's installed and let's jump in game and see what has changed and here we are so now we have one bed, we have tier 4 apartment, and let's place another bed, and it's still tier 4 apartment. So it just works. Now you could have friends, visitors have own bed, or you can just replace the bed. It's completely fine. What if we place third bed? Now it's bunk room. So, as you saw, it works. And then you might ask, can I, 
can I add this uh, mod mid game? Well, this is exactly the same game file what I had on that intro. So yes, you can add this mod mid game. You can remove it mid game. It's not causing any troubles. Very easy to use and definitely will help your life. You don't have to worry about it so much because it can be a pretty big penalty and long term memory that, hey, this king stole my home. I'm sad and I'm angry. So it's, it's a little bit easier, easier noble management and just make life a little more convenient. Hopefully this tutorial was helpful. If it was, hit that like button, subscribe channel if you haven't already done it, and you don't miss any other future awesome Noble Fates videos. Thank you so much for watching, and see you next time.